It was an attack on our frontline police. It was an attack on our parliament. It was an attack on our values and it was wrong. We need to focus on the achievements that we've had, not get divided over a small sector of society uh, fear-mongering what we have chosen to do. Russian President Vladimir Putin has launched a full-scale invasion of Ukraine. Explosions have been heard near the Ukrainian port city of Maripol. Boulders running down the road and you just couldn't, you had no chance of getting up there, right? Young thrill-seeking burglars are committing increasingly brazen ram raids on Auckland businesses. In breaking news, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II has died aged 96. Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern has had her first meeting with the royal family since arriving in London. The Auckland Harbour Bridge has again become the centre of an anti-government protest. Fear, worry, stress, anxiety. These words and the feelings they encompass have increasingly edged their way into our day-to-day -day lives since the start of the pandemic. I felt something was wrong and the mesh had gone through into my bladder. The mayor is going to be a much more important figure in the, in the next year than it's been in the past. A significant eruption occurred from the Hunga Tonga Hunga Ha'apai underwater volcano. The horrifying discovery of two children's bodies found inside suitcases at a home in Auckland's Manurewa has made headlines across the globe. So I look forward to our conversations today. We have a lot to talk about. When you come down and see the vastness of this place, you can uh, appreciate that a, a degree or two will have a phenomenal impact on the world. Stop your troops from attacking the Ukraine. Our black friends all day, every day. Let's go. We're told women's rugby doesn't matter. And then here we are 12 years later, Eden Park sold out, bro. Oh, mate. Women playing sport. How cool could it be?